all right guys what is up it is your boy will back into the video today in this video we'll be talking about two penny stocks the first one will be mullum automotive ticker symbol m u l n do not worry i will make the text a little bigger and the second one will be imperial petroleum ticker symbol i m p p this one is going big um compared to due to the oil so make sure you're mindful of that one this one might be a little lagger, so we might be able to go a little heavier on this one. It depends on the levels and how they hit. Make sure you guys smash that like button, subscribe if you are new, turn your post notifications so you don't miss the updates, and let's go ahead and get straight into it. Now, on the first one, Mullum Automotive, let me type it out so you can see it. Ticker symbol M-U-L-N. I'll do this a little larger right here. There you go, ticker symbol M-U-L-N. Now with this one, like I said, I'll probably go a little heavy on this one because this one's a lagging a little bit, but the second one is actually you have to do with oil. So it's kind of back and forth. I might actually go heavy on both of them if we can get these levels. It's just the second one is a little higher than this one is. So this one isn't too much high in premium compared to the second one. So we'll go over that. So old levels on here. We had an old buying level right around a dollar. And what I wanted is I wanted that pull up and pull back down and then get that buying pressure, right? I drew it. I even drew it out for you of what I wanted. So what do we get? We got that pull up. This, let me zoom out. This, what I wanted is this, right? Pull down what I wanted is this. Buying pressure, not there. Okay, buying pressure is not there. So what I wanted happened. We just didn't get buying pressure, which is okay. There is another entry that I see. This resistance level, we're actually going to leave on there and we're actually going to add one to it. So let's take these levels off. Also the buying level. The new buying level that I want to see is right around 90, I would say about 92 cents. So right now it's a dollar three. So it needs to drop about a dollar. It is dropping after hours because it closed around a dollar and six. So it is dropping a little bit after hours. Around that 96 cent level is the next buying pressure that I'm looking at right there. Okay. So we do need that pullback. Like I said, it's dropping after hours. So it'll be perfect if it hits within like 30 minutes to an hour tomorrow when the market opens. That is when I'm kind of looking for it to hit. First exit, I will hold to about $1.50. That's about a 56% gain. Knowing me, I might exit, I might take some position out around like $1.20 for about a 25% gain. Exit again at $1.50 for a 56% gain. And then I had another exit of about a dollar and like 80 for another 87% gain. I do think it can come up here if we get that pressure. So what I'll do is I actually add, I'll actually add all the exits that I'm looking at right now. And then tomorrow as the price moves, I'll update you guys on this one. So if you do want updates on any one of these, make sure you comment update in the comment section down below. So I know you guys want that. And then I'll update you guys tomorrow on it. So these are the main levels right now that I'm kind of looking out for for ticker symbol M-U-L-N. It all depends on that buying pressure. If it does not drop down to the buying pressure and it goes higher, then like I said, I'll have to give you guys a new buying level. I might see one uh, higher on price, but for right now, I'm focusing on this main one right around 96 area. And it does not have to hit that exact level, but just in that area. All right, guys, video is sponsored by me. Big, big, big announcement with Momo. You can get your Momo account, second link in the description. You can deposit any amount to get up to three free stocks. I, again, you can deposit any amount to get up to three free stocks. Once you open your account, you automatically get one free stock worth of $3 to $3,500. And then you can deposit any amount to get one free stock worth $9 to $3,500. And then you also get a free share of NEO. Okay, so if you ever want to own NEO, this is your time to own it for free. This is only good until March 31st. So this is your time to start getting a free share of NEO, you also get, you could deposit a dollar and you almost make over a thousand percent return on your dollar because you'll get a, a one stock worth of $3, 3,500, $9, 3,500, and also a free share of NEO. So make sure you get your Momo account. Second link in the description. Do not miss it. Also, make sure you get your buy and sell signals. And then when I'm buying, selling for options and shares, we do have the original signals right here. You get my buys and sells. We also have a chat room. We talk in the markets every day. We also have a crypto room where we talk also. So make sure you join. Make sure you get the VIP. VIP is almost full. Once it is full, it will be closed. So make sure you get the VIP. You get four monthly live teaching Zooms. You actually get one every week. You get 24-7 access to the crash course. So the crash course does come in the VIP. You also get your own VIP structuralized plan to better help you trade in this market. Because like I said, VIP is more of me teaching you how to trade. So make sure you join. All these prices are going up soon. 
So make sure you join now. And also if you trade Forex, make sure you come join the Forex Academy. We teach you guys how to trade over here in Forex. Very, very, very important if you guys are in the Forex market. You get 24 hours so your own crash course, trade breakdowns, live Zooms, all that. And then stock market options crash course, you can use will half off to still get 50% off stock market options crash course. And let's go back to the video. Next one, ticker symbol IMPP for M in, uh, Imperial Petroleum. I'll go ahead and type it out also. Ticker symbol IMPP right here. Don't forget to subscribe to the Will Knowledge Crypto channel, second channel on where I post cryptos. A lot of stuff is going to crypto, so make sure you check that out. So ticker symbol IMPP, this is the second one that we'll be talking about today. So two levels, right? We had old levels, all that this doesn't matter anymore. Look how high price is. Now, something funny, the resistance I had around $3 actually tested as a support right here. Okay, bullish sign and went higher. But I was kind of in the end of the market. Didn't really uh, plan to catch that. Let's go back out to the 90-day, 30-minute chart. And like I said, this one is, has strictly probably to do with oil because oil is going crazy. So this one is shooting up also. Now, you know, this one's at very high prices. It is pulling back um, a little bit. You have to remember, this came from around 55 cents and it's up to $7, over 1,300%. So we do not want to be buying, especially trying to buy at these high prices. Now, where I feel comfortable getting a position, I would say is about, I want it to come to about $5. I will also give one more level above this $5 mark, but the one above this $5 mark won't be a heavy position. It'll actually be a lighter position. Because like I said, high prices, we don't want to chase this. Okay, we don't want to chase that at all. We want to be on that downside of buying. Like see this down up this right here. We don't chase that. We get in right here and then we get the profit. So that's what I'm kind of looking for right now. I'm looking for that down move and where it is now from about 7.30. It closed about 7.50. So where it is now about 7.30, it'll need to drop about 30%. Will we get that drop? I'm not sure how old is going right now. That's why I'm going to give you guys one more level kind of above price that we can kind of be looking at. And that is about 680. So it's a little closer to where price is. I do feel it will pull back a little bit. How big that pullback is, we don't know until we see it. So like I said, I'll probably update you guys on these day by day because it just depends on how it moves and how we can do it. But I do think we can get a play in as long as these levels hit. For an exit level, I would say... I would have to wait until I know what type of buying pressure there is. I don't want to give you guys an exit level that really isn't an exit level. So I kind of want to wait for that Pacific exit level. But right now, we'll be looking out for these buying levels. And again, to know if I buy or not, make sure you get the buy and sell signals. First link in the description. Prices will be going up and we'll be closing it once we hit a certain number. So make sure you get your spot. First link in the description. Know what I'm buying and selling for options and shares. And if you stayed this late in the video, you know I have one more bonus for you. Camber Energy, ticker symbol CEI. Old levels here. What we're going to do is, what I'm going to do for you guys for staying this late, I actually have one more buying level that I'll add to this. And that is a little higher, right around 95 cents. So thank you for staying this late in the video. I appreciate you guys. This is one more buying level that I wanted to add to you guys to, to show my appreciation. 95 cents. So instead of 90, we're also looking at 95 cents for buying level. Resistance levels will stay the same because I feel like those would be some targets um, that price might attack once we get these buying levels. Having some pullback after hours, which is good. We want some pullback. We don't want it to just shoot up crazy. Pullback is good. So extra level, 95 cents. Then you got to stay in the slate. Always remember, no recommendation to buy or sell anything. Just for educational purposes only. So do not trade anything you see or hear in the video. And I catch you guys in the next one.